Okay, guys, since closet is done, we're moving in our master bathroom. I am so excited for this one. Okay, before we do anything, if you have laundry, if you have towels, take them and put them to wash. By the time we're finishing here, your towels will be dry and you can put them back. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm gonna get out my towels and go get the ones from the kids' room. I'm gonna go do a little bit of laundry. Okay guys, so detergent is in. I'm gonna do a little bit of baking soda. And laundry is on. Okay, towels are washing. Let's go back into our bathroom. Okay guys, so now that my laundry is going, if you have a window in your bathroom, you wanna open it. But if you don't have a window, just turn on the fan. That's exactly what I'm going to do. And I'm gonna also open the window in my room so that way it will give me some fresh air. Okay, windows open. I love the breeze. Oh my gosh, it's cold outside. You guys, after we're done deep cleaning our entire house, we gotta go do it outside too. Oh my gosh, but the breeze is beautiful. Okay, you guys, also, if your mat is washable, which most of them are, when the, as soon as the towels are done, you wanna throw them in the washer. That way, when you're done cleaning everything, you have clean towels, you have clean mats to put back. Okay, next, what I wanna do is clean out my cabinet. I have it on this side and then on this side. So I am literally going to take everything out, wipe it with disinfective wipes, and put everything back. Deep cleaning, you guys, is not about just to clean, it's about disinfecting. So I'm literally going to take everything out, just disinfect it and put it back. Okay, guys, so let the fun begin. I'm literally going to take everything out, wipe it and put everything back. Oh my gosh, you guys, I hope you're changing your toothbrush every month. They say it's ideal to change it every three months, but since I remember, I've been changing mine every month. So I would literally take the used one, use it to clean my faucet inside and everywhere, and just replace it with a new one once a month. If you guys change with a brush once a month, then we're friends. <laughs> okay, you guys, so I'm done with this one. It looks good to me. Now I have to do this one. But this is not my favorite, but hey, I gotta do it. Um, you guys, don't throw anything away if you don't know what is it for. Because last time I threw my husband's a small charger like this, I threw it away and it was from his most expensive toothbrush. So it cost me $50 for a charger. So don't throw anything away if you don't know. I mean, he has so many chargers though. Like what in the world? But listen, definitely learned. Don't throw anything away that you don't know what it's for. Okay, you guys, and this is how it looks once I'm done. When you clean these type of drawers, you guys, you can use the vacuum, clean out all the hair and then just wipe it down but this is how it looks once I'm done and I did not throw any chargers away. Okay guys, so I'm gonna try a little bit um, a different way to do my towels. I just fold them and throw them in here, but I'm gonna roll them, see if they'll look more prettier. Okay guys, all I did is roll them and I like them so much better. And I do have another load, so this will be full, but I love it. Definitely roll them, it's so much cuter. I do have an empty drawer right here. And I'm just gonna put extra toilet paper that I have. There we go. You make it more useful. Ah! Perfect. Guys, okay, so I'm just cleaning this drawer right here and it has my extra things. And I was going, I was looking at these ingredients, you guys. So X, it's actually my, I hope I'm saying this right, but it's one of my favorites. I know it's not the healthiest, but hey, it's my favorite and it works and okay so it's really good for you guys to look at the ingredients you see how this one says without aluminum and it works you guys the same as this one but this one is literally garbage active ingredients aluminum yeah this is trash 100 percent and this is what my kids use this is a good safe deodorant for the kids Things like this, you guys, don't be afraid. Just toss it in trash. You don't need it. 
we want this clean we're cleaning we're deep cleaning in my last drawer okay guys so don't forget when we deep clean we are actually disinfecting things and we're getting rid of things that we don't need okay guys and this is how it should look once it's done it's all organized so i'm done with this side every single drawer i took everything out wipe it with disinfectant wipes and towels are cute let's see this side is all done this okay so now we're gonna move on to the next side which is my side okay guys let's do this let's see what we have in here uh i don't know you guys one day i'm gonna wake up and do this i'm gonna go back to brunette and we got some makeup wipes uh, not much in this one let's see this is just my hair stuff Right here is just oh my gosh you guys these are the best whitening strips ever they're from amazon they're non-toxic they um my kids start using this too i just finished the bag this is my new pack that just came but um i can link it for you guys to try them i promise you it's the best okay let's see what else do we have okay right here is just boxes yeah not much in here but still i will take everything out clean it just makeup stuff and then okay let's see hair bands and just more okay so let's do this okay this is too funny i barely wear foundation but look how many types i have look how many shades i have you guys and this is what i'm working on help okay guys so all my drawers are done Okay, everything looks good. Oh my gosh, that was loud. Yeah, not much in here or here. Not a lot of changes, but hey, it looks clean. Okay, and this is done. Not a lot to see here. It's just extra shampoos and stuff, but this, you guys, right here, it's my little steamer that I have from Amazon. I take it everywhere I go. It's the best little steamer you'll own. It actually works. I love it. I can link it for you guys. Okay, and then this one. Okay, so this I have all my favorite stuff. Okay, this is the best, my favorite toothpaste that I use. Since we do change a lot of toothbrushes, I get them from Amazon and this one that's so cheap, you guys. Let me show you how they look. There you go. So there's two in every pack. Okay, come on, come on, come on. So there's two in there. So this is how they look. They're literally my favorite. Okay, and then the whitening strips. And you guys, these are literally the best fosters because we bought so many types and these are definitely my favorite. I got, I got them from Kroger. And yeah, that's it. You guys, I was doing my research on what is the most natural way to disinfect. And you're not gonna believe it. Yes, it's hydrogen peroxide. It came to be the number one. You guys, people use this to clean, to disinfect. This literally blew my mind away. So today we'll clean with this, you guys. We'll disinfect, not clean, because this is actually disinfect. And people say it actually kills mold, you guys, mold. If you have mold in the shower, you can spray with this. You can find this at Walmart. You can find this in any grocery store. Even Amazon has it. So, wow. And this is the towels that I use to clean my windows and my counters. And these are the best towels ever. Mine kind of got overused, so I got me new ones. But this is what I use. Okay, you guys. So next, I'm going to clean the jacuzzi. And I'm using this, you guys. I'm going to spray the whole jacuzzi and leave it for 10 minutes. And then I will fill it up with water, put a little bit of soap, and let it run. Okay, you guys, so now the solution has been here for over 10 minutes and now I'm just going to fill it up with water and let it run. Okay, you guys, so now that the height is right, I'm going to turn it on and just let it run. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, it was not, it's not high enough. Okay, you guys, we're going to try it one more time. I think now we're right. Okay, better. <laughs> okay, now we're just gonna let it clean. In the meantime, you guys, don't forget to stop your faucets. Okay, guys, so tub is done. 
and I will link the top tray. This one is definitely my favorite. I had it for so long and it still looks so good. So I will link it. But yeah, tub is done. Okay guys, so now I'm cleaning the cabinet. I got a sponge and put a little bit of dish soap and I'm just gonna start going. And once I'm done, I will get a towel like this and just wipe it. Okay, this will do it. This looks good. I'm happy with this. Okay, guys, it's time to clean up my shower. I'm also going to use this again. I'm going to spray my whole shower and leave it for 10 minutes. And then I will scrub it with baking soda and dish soap. Okay, guys, let's not forget the rules. When we deep clean a shower, we're also disinfecting. That means we're spraying literally everything everything that belongs in the shower and also razor you guys i do change mine very often i will be spraying literally everything and leave it for 10 minutes and then scrub it down and then just rinse it with water so i would spray it on a yellow spot you guys and immediately it will just disappear it's actually crazy do you guys hear this this whole line was actually yellow and in seconds it turned gray. Unbelievable. This is so crazy. This is from Amazon. So I spread my entire shower and I'm gonna wait 10 minutes and I scrub it down. Crazy. Okay guys, so it's been 10 minutes. I'm just getting my baking soda, any baking soda. And I'm just gonna do it on the floor a little bit. Okay, and then I got this brush, I put a little bit of dish soap on it, and I'm just going to scrub it. And you guys, don't forget to wear gloves. I ran out, I did place an order from Amazon, and they are coming tomorrow. So I will have gloves tomorrow, but for today is just coming. Okay, you guys, so I'm done scrubbing my shower. Okay, and now I'm just gonna turn on the water and just rinse it out. I'm trying to eliminate my chemicals. I'm gonna use, I'm gonna clean the shower heads today with a new way. And I'm gonna use baking soda, vinegar, and dish soap. So let's see how this works. And this is how I do it. One gallon Ziploc bag, and I put baking soda. I'm gonna put a little bit of vinegar and a little bit of antibacterial so dish soap. Okay, so right here is dish soap, vinegar, and baking soda. Okay, and then I'm going to go here. This is going to be very hard. I hope I don't fall. Okay, so you basically have to put, you basically have to submerge your head, your shower head in vinegar. And then put a zip tie and leave it for about 10 to 15 minutes. Okay, so it's basically just like this. And just the head, you want it in that vinegar and baking soda. You don't need baking soda and vinegar on the top, just like for the head to be submerged. And now I'm gonna do it on the other side. So on this one, I put a little bit too much. <laughs> just a bit too much. But you guys, if there's any bacteria, mold, anything that shouldn't be there, it will come out. So, yep, we'll leave it for 10 minutes and we'll check it out. You guys, I hope you're ready. I'm scared to look. It's been 15 minutes. Let's see. Okay, let's take it down. Okay, and this is what we got. So every debris and like stuff that was not supposed to be there, it's in here. And I'm so happy. They're clean. And they look so good, you guys. They look so shiny and so good. You guys, they look so clean and so sparkling. I love it. Yep. Love it. 
Okay guys, so I clean the glass door is I take two towels, one wet and one dry. So I do the wet first and then the dry, nothing else you guys. And look how it looks, brand new. You guys, these are literally the best. I mean, look at this, like so good. Wow, I'm telling you, this is what you need around your house. Okay, guys, and so let me show you what I got today from Amazon. It's a foot massager and scrubber. So I got two of them because I want to put it in each side. And this is how it looks. I put one down, you guys. So it's a massager. It literally massages like the bottom of your feet. And let's put some water and soap and see how it scrubs our feet. Oh my gosh, you guys. If you don't have this, you need it and you need it today. This is how we wash our feet, you guys. We don't bend down and... Are you serious? Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay, this is the best thing that I own. And you need it. Like, I am not kidding. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm serious. Okay, this, you guys, is Cups off everything. You guys, you need it. Oh my gosh, I'm definitely gonna link it. But this is something that you need. And if you don't want to buy this one, you want something else, make sure it has the bump. I feel like the bump is literally everything. But you can like, oh my gosh. <gasps> Love it! Worth every penny, you guys. Worth every penny. I literally feel like 10 layers of dirt came off my feet. Like, they, oh my gosh, they feel so good. You guys, you need it and that's it, you need it. Okay, you guys, so if you don't want to leave it, like, fill with water, just wash it like in seconds, and it has this little hook, you can just hook it to let it dry. Like, you guys, come on, this is literally the best. Okay, guys, and so now I'm gonna start cleaning out the counters. I will take everything off wipe my mirrors, wipe the counter, disinfect everything and put everything back. disinfect, cleaned. Uh, I did change his um, deodorant because the other one was not the best. This one has no aluminum. Don't forget to change your toothbrush. And yeah, you guys. This is how I deep clean my bathroom. Everything is clean, white cabinets, drawers, sink, shower. Everything looks good, all cleaned, wiped down. And it's fresh in here, smells good. Ah, it's all done, you guys. I hope you got inspired and you can do the same.